Hello everybody, my name is V Narendra Kumar and we are from NRK Academy and today we have got the 15th story in this wonderful series of Aesop's Tales, the old great Greek writer Aesop Tales who wrote wonderful moralistic stories. 15th story, the stag and the fawn, retold by Leo Tolstoy. And this is in our 500 plus stories of master reading and listening for EFL as EFL resources, English as a foreign language. The stag and the fawn. A fawn once said, once said, say becomes said in the past, to, to referring, to a stag. Father, father, you are larger and fleeter than the dogs. Which means you are smarter, swift, fast than the dogs. And besides, see the commas here. Father, you are larger and fleeter, right, than comparative. The dogs, comma, and, comma, besides. Besides is different from beside. Besides means to tell one more point. To tell one more point. And besides, you have huge antlers for defense. You have huge, big ones, antlers for defense. Why then are you so afraid of the dogs? The stag laughed and said, laugh becomes laughed. You speak the truth, my child. The trouble is, the trouble is, the problem, trouble is problem. The moment I hear the dogs bark, I run before I have time to think. <laughs> the moment I hear the dogs bark, so he is frightened of the barking, the sound. I run, run before I have time to think. So he is not able to think. He gets so frightened. So this is wonderful very 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 wonderful story really if you think about it that sometimes when we get frightened we can't think see such a small story such a genius he was to write such a small story with such a great moral the stag and the fawn a fawn once said to a stag let's see if you can read now a fawn once said to a stag 100% clear father you are larger and fleeter swift than the dogs and besides besides means one more point I will tell you have huge antlers for defense. You can defend yourself by your antlers. Why then, comma, comma, are you so afraid of the dogs? You know, the stag laughed, past tense, laugh becomes laughed, and said, two sentences here actually, the stag laughed, stag said, and is a linking word, and said, you speak the truth, comma, my child, my child, the trouble is, hyphen, He's telling the matter. Hyphen means after that is after is the hyphen means the next point is coming. The moment I hear the dogs bark, the moment I hear the dogs bark, I run before I have time to think. I run before I have time to think. So that completes uh, this uh, wonderful story. You have got this superb reading. I'm sure of it. This way, if you go on reading and reading and reading and reading, one day you will find that anything has become very easy. The same structure again and again and again. All the structures, words are repeating, repeating, repeating. That's how you master reading and listening. Okay, so in the next video, we'll see the fox and the grapes. Thank you so much.